Hey everyone, Waterbot here, and welcome to Black Sea Odyssey. It's a roguelike, set in the ocean, sort of. It's like Space Ocean. Anyway, uh, let's delete that one, because it got all screwed up anyway. I'm not entirely sure how that how it worked out, but still. Okay, this game is kind of loud. There we go, now it works. So this is, we can be Old Man, Raid Lawson, Emerald Jones, or Zizamoth. We've also got these things. Oh, I see, these are like, this is my competition. This is really loud, hold on. Like, I, I, it was too quiet in the beginning, now it's too loud. It's make up your mind game. Okay, this might work. Okay. Tropical, uh, Belch Brothers or Megalark. Difficulty three, difficulty three. Let's go with this one. So, you like fly, you like zoop about on a boat and you throw like harpoons at things. It's weird. Okay. Defeat Megalark to claim your bounty. Alright, so... It's like, I don't know, I, it's hard to explain this one. It's kind of like a twin stick shooter, except for it's way more accurate if you're not twin sticking it. Uh, honestly. But you like throw harpoons, I'm like some kind of weird spa space Zeus. I think that's the edge of the map, yeah that's the edge of the map. There's like monsters all over the place here. That are trying to kill me, and there's like loot too that I can get. I don't know if I see it around though, it's all over the place. Uh, the gameplay is a little bit weird. And a little bit, is this the thing I'm going for? That's it, but it is not... It's not active yet. Okay, maybe I have to do some other things here. Okay, let's just leave them alone until we find uh, proper things to do here. Oh, interesting. Mushrooms apparently uh, block my attacks. Alright, so we've got a ton of frogs that are chasing me around. I guess we should murder them. Primarily, seeing as they are here and waiting. They do some kind of, like, crazy charge move, but I can murder them through. Okay, perfect. Wanna surf in space and throw harpoons? Yeah. I don't know. It's... it... So, I originally, like, got drawn into this... Oh, crap. I got originally drawn into this game because, um... Because it... It seemed like... It was very pretty. I saw GIFs on Twitter, I think, of the... Of, like, the... That the developer was putting up. Just kind of showing off how the various enemies looked and moved and stuff. And honestly, it's kind of flashy, but like, I like it. It's a nice art style, and I actually really wish my character wasn't just a dude on a surfboard, honestly. I like it how it says harpoon every single time I harpoon him. Why is he not dying? Okay, I guess we'll leave it alone for a little while. Something is angry nearby, ha <laughs> ha. Or maybe, maybe he did die, I don't even know. I can't believe I haven't gotten hit yet. We got like a baby around. Maybe I have to chop off the tentacles first. Oh shit, there's there's jungle worm large? There's several different types of jungle worms here, apparently. Oh, I hate the fact that they're all invulnerable from different angles, though. Ha ha! Oh wait, that didn't count as damage? That counted as damage, okay. So I guess glancing blows don't work as well. Good to know. I am bad at this, uh, as far as I can tell. Okay, if I can kill this one. Uh, wait, yep, that did hit me. Okay, finally it died. Let's get the other one down. Because the little one's a lot less... A lot less dangerous. Now, do these rock things that are, like, floating around uh, damage me? I don't know. Well, let's get this small one. I am bouncing off of everything. Okay, well, this is weird. Jungle worms in space. Ow. Yeah, problem is the enemy's cannon will shoot me from uh, across the screen. Alright, well, one way or another. Let's see if we can murder the... Murder him. I think it's the same issue. They don't just immediately die when they get to, like, no hit points, which is weird. I guess I do have to hit the arms properly. Weird. And annoying. So, I, yeah. I've got to injure them the right proper way, otherwise it doesn't count? Come on. Die, you so Oh, God! What the... What the hell are these things? Jungle Frog Large... Ow. I'm Space Zeus, and I'm getting my ass kicked. Or Space... Probably Space Poseidon. Is there, like, healing kits or something? I don't know. I know there's... I, there's, like, several things I can kind of do here to make this work better. Space Frog. But for the most part, it's... I am very weak and getting my ass handed to me. I guess let's just kill Jungle Frog and see if I get, like, some kind of upgrade from this. Because... Killing the jungle frog probably will get me maybe something? It's very large, and usually large enemies... Uh, give me bits. Yeah, we got bits. Whatever the bits do- Oh, hello. Ow. 
I don't know. The music is really good. Uh, the visuals are great. The gameplay is... I don't even know. I don't know what I'm doing. It's just like... Just confusion. And squids. Oh, you can see the corpses just disappearing into the ether. Weird. Well, let's just follow that frog, hitting him a bunch. I think there's like treasure boxes you can... Um, there are treasure boxes that you can open up and stuff. Oh shit, are they destroying the environment? Is that what's going on in here? Can I get this open? No, I need a key. Okay, so yeah, there are treasure boxes nearby, but without some kind of key type thing. Uh, we're not able to- Dap, ah, frog! We're not able to do whatever. I am getting really tired of- uh, 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 uh. Like the, the, the character's grunts get really annoying along the way here. What? It's also kind of weird how I, like, bounce off of stuff. Okay, he's gonna be charging forth. Nope! He's not gonna be charging forth. What the shit was that? That's- is that his tongue? Cripes. I am not okay with this. That does not look okay! Hello! At least him just basically bumping into me doesn't screw me up that much. So, yeah, I think I've- I really wish I could, like, properly destroy his legs. Because I think once his legs are damaged past a certain point... Um... They stop taking damage entirely. We still don't have a key, and we've still got this guy poltergeisting around. Let's see if I can take out his tentacles. Like, the cool thing about procedural damage on a boss, ow, is when you can, um, is we can, when you can, like, chop off bits and make them do different things. Obviously, it's kind of how it works. Uh, problem with procedural, uh, damage on bosses, if you, if you're not actually procedurally destroying things, what's the point? Oh, shit. I think we've got... I think we've got Big Bad hanging out over in this area. The radar is going crazy. Well, let's try and take out the Jungle Worm large first. At least it's dying semi-fast. Oh, crap. It's ba the baby's back. I thought that I killed the baby. Nope. Baby didn't die. Harpoon! Harpoon! Ah! Harpoon! Harpoon! Harpoons for days! Okay. And you're the you're the unfriendliest little cuttlefish. Yeah, die already, Jesus! Like, what part of you is not injured? Do I have to like hit you in the eyes or something? I, I, that is the issue I'm running into here. How do you kill these things? Like, they take damage, and like this thing is so riddled with harpoons, its body mass is like 50% harpoon now. But I haven't sufficiently injured some mysterious part of it that is keeping it from dying. Like. If a part is no longer gonna sufficiently take damage here, then it better just, like, fall off or turn colors or something. I mean, they're all flashing, but still. Die already! Because I am... The, like, things are flashing. It is a very... Oh, shit! Do I really? Ah, nope, and I have now clicked out of the game. Fabulous. My favorite. I apparently have to hit this thing in the eye to kill it. Wow. Get back here so I can poke you in the eye, I guess. What kind of nonsense business is this? Yep. Like, I'm totally cool with a lot of things, but boy, this is frustrating. And, like, I can't really tell why it's wrong. Like, what what is wrong here? Alright, let's try and kill the ba baby by shooting it in the eye. Fortunately, the baby is small, and 90% of the times my harpoons just bounce straight off of baby eyeball. Wow! Why is the medium one easier to kill than this? Yeah, I, can I don't think I can hit this thing pr properly here. Yeah, you have to hit the eye. Good fucking luck! This is nightmarish. I don't actually know if you can hit the baby baby eyeball. Um still don't have any keys. Yeah, he is flashing. Angrily. You're not supposed to kill babies. It's not really a baby, it's just small. But yeah, this this guy is not dying. 
Those hitboxes are tiny. Yeah. Like, look at this guy. He's... All of his bits are flashing in unison. I don't know what it'll take to kill this sucker. Apart from, like, standing directly inside of his bunghole and just... wailing on him. Like, I like the procedurally destructi destructible environments. That, that bit's kind of cool. But, like, if you won't die, what's... Like, what do I do? Like, it'd be cool if there was, like, a bestiary. Like, the frogs were obvious, because they didn't have, like, stupid shell things. You just hit them till they died. I think you had to kill their legs and their whatever. But, like, I, I feel like you should be able to, like... Slowly disable the thing so it, it's its bits don't um, work anymore, and then everything every time you actually hit it, it it still takes damage like as a whole. It's like you have like a one one health bar for the individual parts and one health bar for the other stuff, because like it's got one health bar, and they're all it it has what I'm describing here, but it's not doing it. Wow! I don't know what to say. I don't know what to do here. Like, this thing is so riddled with harpoons. If those harpoons didn't disappear, they would just be... They'd be covering it. This thing would be a veritable pincushion. What do I have to do? Do I just, like, ram it? Do I do some kind of, like, weird Rambo? Do I do some kind of, like, weird Rambo charge? Where I just, like, shove my face straight into its its eye bits and that kills it? Because, like, man, we are harpooning the shit out of this invincible critter. How does it run last? So you die? Yeah, looks like it. And there's no killing this thing. Well, is there anything else for me to do around here? Oh, interesting. I can just plow through the environment. That doesn't seem really lucrative here. Fuck it. Oh, I see. <sighs> and I don't have a key, so I can't open that up. What's up here? Oh, these are new. Maybe I have to kill these things first. Like, maybe those guys do- OH JESUS CHRIST! Maybe those those things don't die until I've like killed a sufficient number of other critters in the environment. Ah! Okay, see that that thing died properly. They're not invincible. In fact, they die with relative ease here, honestly. They're still terrifying critters. Like, this is- this is cool. Now that we're actually back and fighting a thing that's worth fighting... ...that dies... Hey, we get a key. Okay. Like, I'm cool with this again. It's just the invincible enemies that I'm having trouble with, because... ...what's the point of that? I'm also really not sure why, like, floating boulders in the sea slash space... ...um... ...are able to, like, knock me around with such speed and efficiency. I don't really get that bit, but whatever. Okay. So we might still be able to kill those things, but still. Let's go get one of those, uh, treasure chests. I got a fruit, I think. Well, it's... it's a thingy. Okay, so the sonar is only showing one enemy type left. Oh, I don't actually take damage from collisions. Good to know, but that is very expensive. Nonetheless. Okay. So it's just you two. What's that doing? Am I, like, dragging things into me? Yeah, I don't think I can hit this... I don't think I can hit this critter in the eyeball. I honestly could not tell you how to fight this. Just leave or something. Just go away. 
I want nothing to do with you. Okay. Well, what else do we have here? Probably just the other one. Bet it's just bugged. Yeah, maybe. Well, I don't see any other enemies around here. So, I guess I'm gonna have to fart, uh... Form my impressions based on the, uh... On this so far. Ugh. Oh, God! I... So the invincible critter's back. I'm dead. Well, we get a bounty score, so what is what happens beyond this? Oh. Wait, no, me dying just ends it. I thought it would almost be like Rogue Legacy E. Well. The fact that we had totally invincible enemy the enemies there is frustrating. The rest of it was cool, though. Uh, I'm definitely down for playing that some more once those guys are gone or fixed properly. There's a tutorial. It doesn't matter if there's a tutorial or not. There's no specific extra way of... I've already gone through the tutorial, actually. Um, and there's no, like, specific extra thing that you can do to kill stuff. So I, I think they're just bugged or I'm missing something about how to kill those things properly. Uh, either way, though, game is game is awesome. I mean, it's kind of cool from a you know twin stick, twin stick shooter perspective. I wish the uh, sprint meter would charge up a little bit faster because sometimes you really desperately need it, like all the time, honestly. Uh, it looks like there's kind of an upgrade system, but I don't really get it. You don't really get access to it, I think, until you've actually properly beaten the level, which is harder than it looks, apparently. Um, but it's not bad. I don't know. I'm looking forward to it coming out properly and work working fully, because, I mean, those are quite possibly the most horrifying enemies I've run across in a long time. Um, but I think with this, I will see you guys on the next episode of Black Sea Odyssey. Might not be for a little while yet. But, uh, yeah, so I guess if you like this impressions video in any way, shape, or form, leave me a like. Helps more than you know. And if you want to see more, uh, hit subscribe, because once the game is truly playable, I will be playing more. So with that, see you guys next time, and as always, thanks for watching.